Raymeter is an app for Windows that lets you add widgets on your desktop. Now, the problem is that by default, Windows doesn't allow us to put widgets on desktop, so we have to use the Rainmeter. Let's open the web browser here and let's search here for the Rainmeter. Okay, let's click here on the first link, rainmeter.net, and here I assume I have to click on download. So here I'll just click on download. And now we have here the application. Let's go here to the downloads folder. And here I will just double left click on it. And now we have here the installer. Let's click on OK here. For the installation, I will just go with the standard and let's click on install. Let's click on yes here. And that is pretty much it. Let's click on finish and let's see what happens now. Oh, so here we have a few of the widgets on the desktop so yeah i think they look okay now how do i remove them maybe if i put them here to to the bin no maybe if i right click okay now here we have a few of the options let's click here on unload skin okay and let's go here to the right as well maybe click on unload skin as before and let's click on unload skin here as well just like this okay now we have the clean desktop now let's take a look at the ram consumption of the rain meter so if i go here to the task manager and here let's find the rain meter okay here it is and you can see that it uses 15 megabytes of the system memory and let's go here to the system tray and here we have the icon i will just put it here to the system tray for the easier access now let's double left click on it oh here we have a few of the skins so we have the illustro which i assume this is default skin and let's go maybe with the clock let's double left click on the clock and this is the clock skin which comes with the rain meter i will just unload it because i think i will install a few custom skins and then we have here the layouts as well game mode and then the settings okay i'll close this let's find some custom rain meter skins so i'll open the web browser and here let's search for rain meter widgets okay here we have the first page which i think looks promising so let's take a look at it okay here we have visualskins.com many skins are available here which one should i pick maybe this one okay, let's go down here and here we have download option let's click on download and let's click on save here now we have here the mon skin click on the folder maybe and now we have here the mon skin inside the downloads folder i will double left click on it and let's see what happens okay so here we have the rain meter skin installer so here i'll just click on install and let's see what happens now okay so here we have the settings and the other options as well we have here the weather code and the text color maybe i will change the text color to something else so if i click on here maybe we could click here on something different let's say a bit more gray let's click on okay okay now the text looks like this maybe if i change that to let's say pink now we have the pink text but i think that with this wallpaper i think that the white color would look the nicest so if i click on text color once more i will put here the white color and let's click on ok let's close the settings here and maybe change the position here maybe if i right click we have here the variants we have the mont we have the settings here we have the manage skin option edit skin refresh skin rain meter and maybe if i go here under the layouts no there is no way to position the skin on the middle of the screen hmm, maybe if i click on settings if i click on the position here maybe we can click here hmm on desktop but this didn't do anything and then we have snap to edges keep on screen draggable click through and favorite so i think we have to put it somewhere on the screen eyeball it and i will put it somewhere here maybe we could also remove this music player maybe i'll click on right click and unload skin just like this and here i see that we have also this dot maybe i could remove this one as well so right click 
unload and here we also have the recycle bin which i think i will also remove so just like this and now i think we could also make this widget a bit bigger so maybe if i click on right click on the widget let's click here manage skin okay so this does actually nothing and if i go here maybe if i click on edit oh so here we have the notepad let's see what will change the size of the widget maybe the scale right here so if i change this to let's say maybe one point 35 and i see that nothing actually happened so i think i have to go to the file here and click on save and now if i go to the widget maybe i need to do something with the widget here maybe if i right click on it and click on refresh okay so now we have a bigger widget nonetheless but maybe we could also remove the date here and the time so let's take a look here we have meter 24 hour clock here and then we have meter 12 hour clock maybe meter day i think we remove the meter 12 hour clock as well as meter 24 hour clock so let's try this and if i click on file save and then right click and then if i go here and click on refresh skin now we only have the day here and the date but i also want the date to be gone so maybe if i go here down below i will also remove meter date right here so let's try this one here as well just to remove it click on the file and then save okay now let's right click on it and let's click on refresh here and now we indeed have only the day here i will put it somewhere here so it looks nice and now this is it for the first widget let's find a few more so let's open the web browser and here i think that the widgets which look cool are inspired by the mac os so maybe if i search for rain meter mac os widgets maybe we will get some results and now let's click on the first link here oh we have here monterey rain meter okay so how can we get this file get started click install rain meter get our latest release okay i'll just click on latest release here and now we have here the widget and i think i'll just click on this file here and click on save and now let's go here to the browser and let's click on the monterey here and then double left click as same as for the mon skin and now let's click on install okay so now we have one huge widget on our desktop this is how it looks like we have the extras appearance we have language battery support and now we have about here so let's add a few widgets on the screen let's go here to the widgets maybe add clock widget maybe also add calendar and maybe monitoring and the weather maybe also put the music widget here and let's go here to maybe appearance and here we have different colors maybe i'll change that to color and i don't think this one looks good i will go with the blur one and for the extras i will leave it as it is now let's place the widget somewhere here maybe and maybe this one here and this one right here and this one here and this one here somewhere now i think this one looks too big in my opinion so let's try something else if i right click on it oh here we have added the weather and now we have here the city i'll type in here london and i'll click on save here and now we have here the london maybe we can change the size as well so i assume if i click on medium here we have a different size as well let's go with the wide okay let's go with the wide i will put it somewhere here and now we have here the system monitoring maybe we could put this one here and change this one to small okay and now we have here this one maybe change that to wide and put it here and now we have here the clock maybe change this to large or to the white okay the white one looks like this and i think it's okay now here we have the music widget maybe if i change this to large Oh, this one is actually too big. Maybe if I do here wide. Okay, I think it looks okay. And put it somewhere here. And now let's see how much of the RAM does the rain meter actually use with this six widgets or seven widgets on our desktop. So if I go here to the task manager, let's see here. Okay, we have here other processes. Maybe if I go here down below. Okay, so here we can see that rain meter takes around 
4% of the CPU and 51 megabytes of the memory, which is 35 megabytes increase. So by default, it takes 15 megabytes on my computer. And now with the seven widgets on desktop, it takes 50 megabytes, which isn't a lot to be honest. And with that said, if you guys enjoyed this kind of video, make sure that you smash up the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you're interested in more customization videos, I think you would really like this one, which you see right now on the screen. So make sure that you click on it right now. Have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you all around in the next video.